Samsung's upcoming Galaxy S26 Ultra is expected to be one of 2025's most powerful phones, largely thanks to the new Exynos 2600 chip. After years of criticism, Samsung seems ready to make a strong comeback, with this processor built to rival Qualcomm's Snapdragon 8 Elite. Built on Samsung's second-gen 2M process, the Exynos 2600 promises major gains in performance and efficiency. It features a Cortex-X5 core with supporting a 7X and a 5X cores, plus an Eclipse 940 GPU based on AMD's RDNA 3 architecture, offering console-level graphics and smart AI optimizations. Early Geekbench 6 results show scores around 3,309 single-core and 11,256 multi-core, outperforming last year's Exynos 2400 and even matching or beating Snapdragon's latest chips. These numbers mean faster app performance, smoother multitasking, and stronger video editing capability. However, these results are from prototype units with ideal conditions, so final numbers may drop slightly once retail models are tested. Even so, Samsung's progress is clear. With its Tutum efficiency boost and advanced AI integration, the Exynos 2600 could signal Samsung's return to the top. Leaks suggest the Exynos 2600 will power most Galaxy S26 and S26 Plus models globally, while the S26 Ultra will use Snapdragon 8 Elite in the US and China, and Exynos elsewhere. If these leaks are accurate, the Exynos 2600 could be Samsung's biggest comeback yet, proving its chips can once again compete with the best in the industry. According to Ice Universe on X, the Galaxy S26 Ultra's 3X camera features a 10 megapixel sensor with an f/2.4 aperture and a 1/3.94 inch sensor size. On the other hand, the Oppo Find X9 Pro's 3X camera is on a completely different level, boasting a massive 200 megapixel sensor, f/2.1 aperture, and a 1/1.56 inch sensor. Ice Universe points out that Oppo's sensor is 6.4 times larger than Samsung's, allowing for 8.3x more light intake and a 20x increase in pixel count. In simple terms, Oppo's setup promises significantly more detail, better low-light performance, and overall superior image quality. He then asked an interesting question. Which one would you choose? Sparking conversation among users about whether Samsung is starting to fall behind in the camera race. But Samsung seems to think otherwise. In another post shared by ICE, Samsung's official newsroom page proudly highlighted their 15 years of camera innovation under the tagline, Always One Step Ahead. The company emphasizes that for over a decade and a half, Samsung has continuously pushed smartphone photography to new heights, redefining what a mobile camera can achieve especially with the power of Galaxy AI now playing a central role in editing and image processing. So while Oppo might be making bold moves with hardware, Samsung is clearly betting on the perfect blend of AI intelligence and sensor optimization to maintain its lead. Now the question remains, will Samsung's combination of AI and advanced image tuning be enough to stand tall against Oppo's massive camera sensor? Let's wait and see what the Galaxy S26 Ultra truly delivers when it officially launches. A creative user designed a boxy version of the S26 Ultra, and honestly, it looks stunning. The design features sharper edges and a sleek titanium-like matte finish that gives the foam an industrial yet luxurious look. What's even more interesting is that well-known tipster CID reacted to this concept. He shared the image on X, commenting that he personally prefers rounded corners instead of the boxy look. His post sparked a lively debate among Galaxy fans, some agreeing with CID's preference for smoother curved edges, while others praised the bold and modern boxy design for giving the Ultra Series a more professional, premium aesthetic. But CID didn't stop there. In another post, he he revealed a lineup of concept color options for the S26 Ultra, including a deep metallic blue, a classic matte black, and a clean pearl white. CID confidently stated, black is always the best color on a phone, and you can't prove me wrong. And honestly, the black variant looks incredibly elegant with its stealthy matte finish and bold camera layout. Shortly after, another designer named Rasik Rastogi joined the conversation by sharing his own concept renders, featuring the S26 Ultra in red, purple, and green color options. Each of these shades enhances the phone's striking design, giving it a futuristic and ultra-premium vibe, the kind of color range fans would love to see Samsung officially introduce. If Samsung actually takes inspiration from these fan-made renders, the Galaxy S26 Ultra could become one of the most visually impressive and stylish flagships we've ever seen. Whether you prefer the boxy frame or the rounded edges, one thing's clear, the upcoming Ultra is already turning heads long before its launch. Recently, a user on X named Sample the first dummy units of the Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra, and we were among the first to cover this topic. This time, several well-known Samsung leakers reacted to the post, revealing the possible colors of the upcoming Galaxy S26 Ultra. Ice Universe shared the post without adding any caption or comment. If Ice has shared this post, I believe these are the actual colors that will be coming to the Galaxy S26 Ultra. According to tipster Tarun Vats, Galaxy S26 Ultra dummy units leak in color, why does it look so close to iPhone 17 series, sparking quite a debate among fans about Samsung's design direction. 
Meanwhile, Tipster and Thony shared some promising details about the Galaxy S26 Ultra's specifications, highlighting several major upgrades. The Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra is shaping up to be a powerhouse, featuring the latest Snapdragon 8 Elite Gen 5 for Galaxy paired with a larger vapor chamber cooling system for improved performance. It sports a stunning 6.9-inch M14 QHD plus COE dynamic AMOLED display and even includes a built-in privacy screen feature. The camera setup is equally impressive with a 200-megapixel slash 1.4 main sensor, a 50-megapixel ultrawide lens, a 50-megapixel 5XF slash 2.9 periscope lens, and a 12-megapixel 3X telephoto lens. Powering it all is a 5,000mAh battery with 60-watt wired charging support. The device offers up to 16 gigs of RAM with storage auctions of 256 gigs, 512 gigs, or 1 TB, along with 25% faster RAM data transfer speeds, all packed into a sleek 7.9 millimeters thin body. In another post, Anthony added that integrating a built-in privacy screen directly into the device is a remarkable addition, making the S26 series even more appealing. The Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra is powered by Qualcomm's latest Snapdragon 8 Elite Gen 5 chip, built on TSMC's advanced 3 nanometer process with the new Orient CPU architecture. The Prime Core now hits speeds up to 4.6 GHz, pushing performance beyond anything we've seen before. In early Geekbench tests, the Snapdragon 8 Elite Gen 5 scores around 3,831 in single-core and 12,459 in multi-core, showing a massive jump over last year's Gen 3. That's flagship-level power across both raw speed and multitasking. On the GPU side, the new Adreno architecture brings a 20-23% to performance boost while using about 20% less power. That means smoother gameplay, higher frame rates, and far fewer drops during long gaming sessions. The upgraded Hexagon NPU is about 35-37% to faster, making on-device AI, camera processing, and real-time upscaling much more efficient. In real-world use, you can expect lightning-fast app launches, ultra-smooth multitasking, and professional-grade video editing, all while keeping better thermals and battery life. So if these numbers hold true, the Snapdragon 8 Elite Gen 5 could make the Galaxy S26 Ultra one of the most powerful smartphones ever built. We finally have the first real look at the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S26 Ultra and it's absolutely stunning. These new images give us the clearest view of Samsung's next big flagship, and yes, it's bringing a color that's turning everyone's heads. According to Tipster Sample, these are the final design leaks of the Galaxy S26 Ultra, showcasing three elegant finishes, silver, gold, and the all-new Cosmic Orange. And that's where the real shot comes in. Samsung's Cosmic Orange looks bold, premium, and incredibly refined, a shade that instantly separates it from every other phone on the market. The matte finish gives it a luxury feel, and a tone perfectly complements that clean titanium frame. According to the latest leaks, Samsung is testing software for the Galaxy S26 Edge and S26 Ultra, confirming that both will launch with One UI 8.5 based on Android 15. The Galaxy S26 Ultra, model number is SMS948X, has started firmware testing across multiple regions. S948 NKSU 0 AVA5 South Korea, S948 USQ 0 AVA5 6 US carrier variant S948 U1 UU0 AMOLED J5 US unlock variant S948 BX U0 AVJ5 global version According to tipster Anthony the Galaxy S26 Ultra is packing some serious upgrades under the hood He mentions the best anti-reflective layer class leading performance vapor chamber cooling and more all packed inside an 8.2 millimeters titanium frame. That's an impressive combination, especially when you realize that Samsung is managing to keep the body sleek while improving thermal management and durability at the same time. Titanium is already known for being strong and lightweight, but pairing it with advanced cooling and a reflective layer means the phone isn't just tough. Thank you so much for joining me in this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in the next video. Peace out.